Good morning, welcome to Paris Vlogs Day 2. Um, right now we are going to go down, there's a, three times a week there's an outdoor little market, um, and it's like basically right in front of the hotel. The um, owner, or the hotel, the apartment, the owner um, had mentioned it, so he said, yeah, Thursday, I think Saturday and Tuesday or something. Anyway, so we're gonna go today, um, see what there is, and then we're also gonna stop at a bakery and get some croissants or some breakfast. It's about 8.30 now. Um, and then we're gonna bring it back up here and then start our museum day. So, yes, it's very cold. I think it says it's about two degrees, Burr. but we do have jackets. <laughs> So we got two pain au chocolat, chocolate bread, <laughs> and then two croissants. And we said tomorrow will be, there were some other things. There was like an apple thing, pastry. So I was like, oh, let's try that tomorrow. Um, the market wasn't open yet. It, we think it only opens around nine and it's like quarter to nine. And so we'll, on our way out, we'll go and check it out first. So let's try their croissant. Mmm. -hmm. That's so buttery and good. Mm. Did you eat your chocolate one yet? Mm -mm. Mm. I wanted to see what it looks like inside. So the pain au chocolat, you don't really see it, but there's just chocolate down the bottom. But it's just as nice and buttery and flaky as the oven. So today, um, once we finish our breakfast, we are going to just, yeah, check out the market. Um, but they have like fruit and flowers, well, obviously we're not going to buy flowers, but just some other stuff too. And then we're going to go to Notre Dame and look at it inside. And then also the catacombs. That's... Um, crypt. 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 And then Musée, or no, Hotel des Invalides, so that's Napoleon's tomb. Um, looking around there. And then we were planning to do the Louvre, but in our plans we had written what time it was open till and we thought well anyways I looked wrong so I thought Thursday it was open till 10 but that's incorrect it's Friday so we're gonna switch it up we're gonna add, put the Louvre tomorrow and then what we're gonna do well we're seeing Versailles tomorrow but then also we're gonna do Dorsay so we're gonna do Dorsay today so Notre Dame Hotel de des Invalides and then Dorsay right <laughs> Okay, that's gonna be our day. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna start our day now, going out to the museum, Notre Dame first, and catacombs. Um, I'm dressed like that. I have my short jacket on that I bought the day before we left. <laughs> I was like, what if I don't want to keep always wearing my like long um, coat? So I have a short one on with my scarf. I only brought one scarf, but I actually really like this, so I totally will buy another scarf when I'm here. Because it's true, everyone wears like dark clothes, but then it's nice to have some kind of color up here. Anyways, and then I have my friend's purse. Um, so I have, well in my pocket up here I have some money and um, like my debit card and my uh, driver's license. I'm not carrying around my passport, but that's like right here and zipped up and so no one's gonna, you know, go pickpocket that. Um, so my bag, it's basically stuff that if it gets you know, if someone takes my purse, it's not the end of the world. Um, so I do have like Kleenex, an umbrella, hand sanitizer, down put in some Tylenol. Um, what else? Oh, a, like an, a refoldable bag, um, granola bar. Um, pretty much it. Oh, a tiny little thing of water that I got on the plane. Or do you want me to take the big water bottle? You think we'll be thirsty? So a little water bottle. Um, and then I have my, um, in here, just a little point and shoot camera. Um, not necessarily for today, but I was thinking if when we go to the Eiffel Tower and stuff, um, even though, like, cause Dan and I would want to have a picture together. And so I was like, I don't really want to give my brand new iPhone to someone just in case they're, you know, pretending to be tourists, but then I'm going to steal my phone. Um, so anyways, I just brought a tiny little Canon, um, that I, I mean, the last time I used this was probably like three years or two years ago, um, but it's still, yeah, just good to have. So if it's a situation where we want to ask someone to take a picture, you know, asking a tourist as well, but still, then it's that. It just made me feel better than losing that. Um, but then I have, I think, like a 10 euro in there as well, but that's in a second zippered pocket in the zippered bag. So, all right, we're all ready to go. So this is the market. 
we made it to Notre Dame and yeah it's only like a five minute walk now since they don't have locked bridges people are locking so we should have brought a lock like I said to lock in our love but anyways we're gonna walk down here by the river and then just go back up again but we were looking at it last night but it was a little dark so we didn't this looks pretty cool <laughs> Bateau is when we take the but the when we take the bateau mouche it doesn't come to this section it goes the, oh it does so it goes all around ah. This is a garden outside of Notre Dame. So I can see a beautiful rose window. We're just waiting for it to turn 10 o'clock so we can go and visit the crypts. So now we're going to check out the crypts for the Jeep. We first got on the metro going the wrong way, but we figured it out by the next stop. And <laughs> so we're on our way here. And look, we can see the Eiffel Tower in the distance. <gasps> so cool. And then we're going over there. Right there. Cool. So now we are at the Army Museum, Hotel d'Invalide. We toured the museum, all the different ones now. It's about one o'clock now, but we're still gonna see the um, Napoleon's tomb. We're gonna walk to Orsay now. We're at the Musée d'Orsay, um, which is behind me. We're just looking at the scene. <laughs> is that the boat we're gonna do? Or no, yeah, it's a different one. The other way. Oh, okay. Oh, no, no, you're right. We finished at Orsay and now we get to do some shopping. We're going to the Bazaar, Bazaar de la Hotel de Ville, um, BHV, which is a more affordable department store than Gallery Lafayette. We'll still go to the Gallery Lafayette, but not right now. <laughs> it's just so expensive. So we're walking through the Tuileries Garden, um, but we're going to be seeing the Louvre tomorrow, so we're going to check out and walk more in the garden, but now we're just kind of going from one side to the next to catch the metro to the shopping center. So we didn't find much shopping, but now we're just walking back to our apartment, making our way home. We're outside the Hotel de Ville, which is City Hall. And in the square, there's a little carousel over there. We are back home again. We had a really long day of walking. Oh my goodness. Um, on my phone, I have a step counter and it locked in, I think, 27,000 steps. 
and typically they say you should get at least 10,000 a day at home usually I get that because I walk the dogs but not always if I just do like quick walks anyway so I usually get around like 9,000 steps so 27,000 steps oh no wonder I'm tired um in the afternoon we were kind of getting a little jet lagged but we you know stuck through it and yeah now we're home we ended up not finding anything at yeah like I said the um department store but it was still fun to look um, but so many things you can buy like they're like Tommy Hilfiger brand and this brand I'm like well I wouldn't buy that here <laughs> so uh, that's good anyways um you already saw my grocery haul that I posted a while ago but it's for today so now we're gonna try these cookies Tartlet chocolat caramel and they come individually wrapped which is kind of cool so this is what it looks like and then we will make dinner because it's like seven o'clock now I think a little much on the cookie ratio because <laughs> in the picture it looks like all that caramel inside you can see that caramel gushing out and here it's like a tiny little bit of caramel so I would not buy these again <laughs> but I will enjoy them and we have other cookies too <laughs> So now that we've relaxed for a little bit, we don't feel like cooking. So we just have our wine, ooh, the rosé wine, which is okay. It doesn't taste as strong, obviously, as the red wine, but it's just okay. Um, and then we are eating just our brioche bun. Mmm. Mmm. French bread is so good. Mm -hmm. It's like a little sweet, and even this, it like, this is like the cheap melts bread, in your yeah. mouth. It's yeah. So good. Oh. Mm -hmm. We also just got the generic store brand. Mm. Yeah, even the bakeries at home can don't make it this good. I know. I don't know what. They use a different mm -hmm. recipe or something? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This was just packaged. It wasn't even from an actual, like, only bread bakery. We're just gonna relax. We're watching Gilmore Girls in French on TV. <laughs> But the thing is, because I've watched Gummy Girl so much, I probably know the storyline. Well, like, I know what happens in the episode anyway, so then I can kind of follow along. But they speak so quickly, so it's mm -hmm. kind of hard to. So I ended up having, well, making some salad too, because I felt bad that I wasn't having any, any veggies. Um, and then I have some of the baguette, because baguettes only stay good for about a day, and then they get really hard. So I got the baguette and a salad. Um, so we're just still watching TV and. It's probably about nine now. We gave Dan's parents a call while well, with FaceTime. We chatted to, with them a little bit, and I've updated my mom just and talked to my sister saying I'm okay and sent them some pictures and stuff. Yeah, so we're just gonna hang out for a little bit, watch some more French TV, try to improve my French skills, uh, listening skills at least. Even at like when we go to the grocery store or places, I'm just like, I give Dan my money ahead of time. I'm like, okay, you pay <laughs> because they say it so fast and then I just don't know what they're saying and so yes he takes care of it because he knows what they're, he can understand them. so anyways just going to have my salad and baguette and that's gonna be it tonight so tomorrow we have a very busy day even more walking than today we're going to Versailles and then the Louvre is open until 10 p.m. so we're gonna do a late viewing of the Louvre as well um, well kind of in the afternoon evening and yeah so two things that can take days to look at but we're doing them both in the same day so crazy day but hopefully we won't be as jet lagged anymore because now in the afternoon we were still pretty tired and now I'm exhausted so yeah that's gonna be it tonight and we'll see you guys tomorrow <laughs> bye